Hey Leos, welcome to your November 2022 general reading with myself, Thomas Janak. You're watching Thomas's Tower readings. Please like, subscribe, and share. And if you like my work, you can now buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. Now, what we do here is we will divide the reading into sections so it's a bit easier to understand. We will first look at the overall energy for the months ahead before we then look at your emotional core and then lastly we look at opportunities as they present themselves to you in the month of November. But before we do any of this, there are a few things that um, are worth mentioning when it comes to November. Number one, November is the 11th month. 11 is a master number. And it is the strongest master number there is. A master number is the same, same, same uh, double digit number. And 11 is the strongest, which means the energy of 11, this powerful energy, um, which, which, which will give you more drive, which also allows you to see through stuff, um, will be with all of us, with every star sign, um, literally for the entire month. So that is really good. The downside this month is that um, we have the full moon on the 9th or the 10th, I cannot remember uh, off the top of my head. But this full moon in November is also a lunar eclipse. And what that means, uh, means that, they are, that it can bring out the worst in us, if that makes sense. I will explain this uh, deeper and um, a bit more coherent, I suppose, in the um, full moon reading for November, that you can find also on this channel. I would suggest you check this out after you're done here. Okay. Um, so, but that dip will only be for a couple of days. So by mid-month, you should be back into your strengths. In any case, let's have a look at the overall energy for the months ahead for the sign of Leo. Now, Leos, you have the spider as your overall energy. And what that means is for you to realize how much space you give to others should be your choice, should be your decision. So ask yourself, reflect on who is a pain in the neck, right? Who do I have to, you know, take under uh, under my wings and, 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 you know, who forces me to always be there, right? And does that allow me uh, to actually uh, recharge my battery? So they're asking you to understand that the spider is the animal that creates the web of life. And in November, it is really important to reflect on who in your life and what situations in your life may cause you to have less time and space and energy left for yourself and to yourself. Okay, that was the overall energy for the month of November for the sign of Leo. Now, Leo, let's have a look at your emotional core. Short and sweet for you. <laughs> you have the monkey. I can't. Here, here you go. Well, the monkey, again, is symbolism. The monkey literally denotes the past. And what the guides are saying to you, if you want to move forward with regards to your healing, and if you want to move forward, forward with regards to relationships um, that you're either in or that you're seeking, move into the relationship from the from the energy of now right don't go in there and 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 be someone that you're not if that makes sense just because other people did hurt you doesn't mean that the next person will do and you certainly shouldn't punish someone for the crap that someone else did so what i'm getting here with the monkey is one of the reasons why things might be difficult for you uh, if you should you be in a relationship to bring this to another level or are you looking if you're looking for a relationship to make this work and actually manifest it is to make sure you're not thinking backwards right it's about manifesting it's about understanding i've been through this right and i will not make that mistake again <laughs> that in itself will automatically manifest uh, a different kind of person well if there's any trauma inside you that still needs to be triggered a new person which will be much nicer <laughs> will still have to trigger some of the things that you still need to learn which is why there is never sort of a mr or mrs right <laughs> if that makes sense right but in your case this is the, the this is the message for your emotional core 
don't be in the past. Don't let yourself be defined by the past. And if this is not about relationships for you, if something has happened in the past that has deeply hurt you, could be bereavement actually um, as well, <clears throat> try not to take it forward, right? Um, allow yourself to be, to be in the strength that November affords you simply by being the 11th month, okay? Now, lastly, let's have a look at the... Um, at the opportunities as they present themselves to you in the month of November. And you have the insects. So what that means, when it comes to opportunities, only go to where people understand how valuable you are. If you're doing a lot of menial work simply because um, nobody else uh, can be bothered. So if you're doing four or five jobs, if that makes sense, and you're not feeling that what you actually were employed for is what you're being uh, uh, what you're being asked to do. So all these scenarios where you're doing more than you probably should and where you're not as acknowledged, that is something that the insect, because it's the it's the, the most successful group of all animals, without them nothing would work. So understand that that you have skills and that your time is precious and that you're valuable and bring this into anything and everything to do with what sustains you financially you want to go for a new job don't sell yourself short right and don't hold back right so there's what i'm getting is this um they're not asking to have to show bravado uh bravado what what i'm hearing is is when people ask you about um opinions in interviews Tell them your opinion. If they then go, oh, we, we are not, we're not going to employ you, well, someone else will. So the, the point is, what I'm getting is for you, um, is to understand um, when it comes to opportunities, anything and everything that you will or ought to engage in has to have merit with regards to people seeing and understanding and showing and acknowledging that you are wanted in the position you are looking for and that you are appreciated uh, in whatever it is you want to do. So don't, please, 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 don't sell yourself short, okay? That's all we got time for. So um, see you all next month. Bye-bye.